All right, we good morning this morning. We're going to kind of miss out on the clearing uh, job. We got to go back here and dig out a poopy tank for a guy. And uh, going to do something fun. So, it is what it is. Little narrow road back through here. Uh, it's pretty hard to get off the road down there. It's steep. It rolls off. But uh, we'll go back here and dig this tank out, guys. Hang on. Well, well, weenies, I missed the best part. We got it dug out, and uh, I gotta show you guys that. Yep, it's full. Yep, it stinks. It's pretty rough smelling. So I don't think their uh, distribution box is exactly working like it should. So uh, we got the lid laying over there. Groundhog struggled a little bit pulling the lid up out of there. Once they got it out of there, it can handle it good. But uh, I'll try to video them pumping it and us pulling the lid and all that, putting the lid back, whatever, and uh, covering it back up. All right, Weenie. I'm not sure uh, how much uh, video I'll get today on this project here. My. Uh, mount for my excavator kind of broke but uh we went over and dug a septic tank out you see that there that was this morning uh child and uh they said they'd be here in a couple hours to pump it that could be dinner time or whatever it's almost 10 o'clock now so the old fence come out here and come up and come out this way I wanted to go around the boundary, which was then down there next to the road, but uh, that right down through there ain't nothing but a rock cliff, and there ain't no way a man get no post in there. So what we're going to do is clean this corner out, bring our fence up here and around, and that'll have that fence down. That's the old spring house, is what that is. Used to be a spring there, but we're going to have that fence down. We're gonna come out the top of this right here where I cleaned it off. You can see the old fence there. It goes out here at the corner with that little tree and that light pole. And then it takes off down the hill down toward that other house. So uh, we're gonna start right down through there, work our way down through there and uh, try to clean that out. And I'll have to break his limbs off of this. And uh, Try get down through there. I gotta watch. We got power lines up here overhead. You gotta be beware of your surroundings on a job like this. Uh, you don't ever know where the power lines might run through the woods at. And uh, this power line actually comes from the top of the hill down here to this pole and then goes down to that house. Why they done that, I don't know, but it is what it is. The transformer for that house is actually all the way up here on top of the hill. I think I would have read that it been down here somewhere, but whatever. Uh, the power pole here, that's the phone pole down there. And uh, you won't see the power company put their line on the phone pole or the phone line put it on the power line. If they do, they have to pay them for it so they just don't drive usually. But that fence runs right up through there, and that's where we're headed, guys. So, hang tight. I'll get you some video if I can. Yeah, yeah. All right, we need to see what we're uh, we got a hold of here. He uh, ran over the bank just a little. Kind of got stuck. I don't believe I want to try to tackle that with the groundhog. I don't believe the groundhog bite off of that much. He's uh, over the bank. Kyle's a uh, quality towing, so we'll see how it goes.
tow truck finally made it. <laughs> Short lived on the clearing job. Uh, we came over here, dug this up, went back over there to start clearing, and uh, he showed up. So we went here, pitched the tank, covered it back up. Uh, they pumped it, and we had to drill a hole in it. I had to patch that, cover the tank back up, and uh, we're going to watch them pull them out, I guess. See how it goes. So, this is uh, quality towing. They get this thing hooked up. You can pull it out. Hope for the best. The uh, septic tank, the truck down there that pumps the septic tank, I didn't really get a video of it, but on the lower side, uh, it actually sat down on a T-post and uh, towed the wheels up off of the ground. I feel like if it went to the T-post, it would probably turn over. It was. It's a nice thing here. Big out there. T-post he was sitting on. <coughs> T-post he was sitting on that there, guys. I about broke my leg in that cattle guard. That yeah, wasn't too bad. I wonder if we could have put him out with a tractor. He just wouldn't try to get one of these bumps before it. There he is. He's out.